U.S. judge says SEC lawsuit versus Ripple Labs can proceed to trial on some claims. U.S. District Judge Annalisa Torres said Ripple Labs Inc.'s institutional sales of its XRP digital token violated federal law because they constituted the unregistered offer and sale of investment contracts, according to a ruling on Thursday. The SEC had accused the company and its current and former chief executives of conducting a $1.3 billion unregistered securities offering by selling XRP, which Ripple's founders created in 2012. Breaking. Ripple wins case against SEC as judge rules. XRP is not a security. CEO Brad Garlinghouse recently opined that the case would end soon, but the fight for crypto wasn't over yet. Ripple Labs scored a victory in the United States District Court in the Southern District of New York on July 13, as Judge Annalisa Torres ruled in favor of the company in a case brought forth by the Securities and Exchange Commission dating back to 2020. According to documents filed on July 13, Judge Torres has granted summary judgment in favor of Ripple Labs, allowing that the XRP 60 cents token is not a security. The SEC lawsuit sought to compel Ripple to stop offering its XRP token under the premise that XRP was a security and, thus, required additional regulation. Per court documents viewed by Cointelegraph, defendant's motion for summary judgment is granted as to the programmatic sales, the other distributions, and Larson's and Garlinghouse's sales, and denied as to the institutional sales.